started dating someone who was a heavy drinker and I really got into just keeping up with him. And we eventually got married. I made a lot of mistakes in our marriage. I didn't speak up a lot and the less I spoke, the more I drank. And it just continued to snowball and um, we ended up getting a divorce and in that divorce I just hit the bottle hard. My mom and my sister very much so tried to intervene. My dad and my stepmom, um, they had pretty much cut me off. They were, they thought I was a lost cause because I was. I was causing heartbreak. Dove House um, was a miracle. Um, my stepmom was delivering um, dental supplies to the dentist to the front of the building and Miss Wendy thought that she was making a donation to Dove and they got to talking and she said you know my daughter is in a really bad place and Miss Wendy said you know let's bring her in for an assessment and we'll go from there. So it was divine intervention that I ended up at Dove. So reflecting back on my story like you can have it all and you can absolutely be suffering on the inside and nobody will know. And one, like I, I had a house, I had four cars, I had my own business to staying at the Wheeler Mission or not knowing where I was gonna stay next. And definitely hitting rock bottom in sobriety has taught me that, you know, you don't need a lot, you just need to be sober and you need to love yourself. Um, I learned to live very simply here which is also a huge gift. You don't need to have all the beautiful, shiny things. They're nice, um, but you know, I work a second job at Dollar Tree. I love it. I love the simple clocking in and out and seeing my regular customers and stocking shelves. And just life can be simple and it can still be so beautiful. Dove House has opened doors that I didn't even know existed in my self-confidence and my faith. I owe everything to Dove House. Um, so I want the, the opening doors theme, like I want everyone to know that, you know, just because you have, one door may have shut with your active addiction, but so many more doors are going to open as soon as you get on the recovery train.